You've been getting stronger lately, haven't you? I can see your father's power in you. Something funny? You... You have no idea, do you? About your father? My father is a pilot who died in a no, plane crash. No, your real was... father. Not the poor sap who married your mother. You must have heard stories. I don't want to talk about it. it. Your father was a member of the Hellfire Club. More than a member. A king. That makes you royalty. What, because you got my mother pregnant? That has nothing to do with me. No, we are running out of time. Then I'll buy us some more. Listen, I'd love to chat, but I'm sort of busy here. Yeah, that is good. Out there, you got powers. But in here, I got powers. Well, then I bet you're pretty glad you met me in here. Looks like she's doing just fine without you. Fall back. There's nothing noble about struggle and sacrifice. It's just a pretty name for losing. You're not a killer, Lorna! This isn't why the X-Men chose us. The X-Men made a mistake. This is who I am. I'm tired of hiding. The X-Men chose us for a reason. It's not because we can kill. <sighs> yeah, so you're fast, but you don't have eyes in the back of your head. You gonna talk to us? Lorna, what are you doing? Just letting her know we're serious. You think she's gonna talk to you if you stab her? Put the knives down. I'm worried about you. The way that you tore down that telephone pole, you haven't been sleeping at all. Do you think that you might be- Having a manic episode? No. This is not about my mental illness, Marcos. This is about theirs. <laughs> Stand down or I will open fire. Have you ever been so angry about someone you love getting hurt that you would do anything to stop the pain? Little favor? Call me Polaris. I'm changing. Everything's changing. Lorna, you can do things others can't. Your friends, they... they Stop they... talking about my friends! It's time to make a new world. Ah!